right, Jeff, a bounce back effort from Smith, though, combined with maybe some production from Connor McDavid and company. That, that'll get the Oilers back in this thing. Oh, absolutely. I mean, that that's that's it's just it's what they need. I mean, if Mike Smith doesn't bounce back, you know, the, the Oilers just will not have the confidence to overcome what is a tough checking um, Calgary Flames team. But if, if they do get that again on the on the flip side and 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 I think Mike Smith has shown like he's already done it. He's bounced back from bad performances, from bad gaffes really quickly. So I really don't hate taking the Oilers on the money line tonight. Um, if you want to play, you know, if you just don't like that. I also think looking at some of these props down in the lineup, I mean, we're going to get a fast back and pace uh, back and forth series. And, you know, th there's some really nice lines that you're getting, especially on the Oilers. Like when you go down their lineup, like a Jesse Pupiarve or Kyler Yamamoto and even Ryan Nugent Hopkins, all these guys are plus 300 or bigger to score a goal. Why not take two of them? Why not take like Yamamoto and, and Pupiarve and, and one of them scores. Absolutely. You balance your bets. You're going to get make major profit here tonight. So, if you're looking for goal props, I would really look down the Oilers lineups. A lot of these role players playing pretty significant roles for them. And they're really kind of undervalued, it just looks like, because, again, they're coming in as a slight underdog. So look at the Oilers role plays for goal scoring props. I throw out three names there. Take two of them and roll the dice.